because we've all been holding the notion that we live in a desert and we don't have water and so we have to bring it from three rivers into Los Angeles, the Sacramento, the Owens, and the Colorado. We don't see and understand the rainfall, how much it is and how much it can help us. When it rains an inch here, we throw away uh, 3.8 billion gallons of water per inch, but half of that is capturable runoff that could be our supply. What I want you to see is that the land is naturally mulched. Water that would fall would make its way slowly, safely to the river. That soil cleans it recharges the aquifer, waters the plants, protects from floods, and that's what our Native American family members took care of. So then we did this. So we took that very same land, we put our city here, not understanding nature, and they did a really good job of keeping water and people apart. So LA is now two thirds paved. We continue to overbuild LA beyond what they thought. They spent almost a half billion dollars in the early 2000s to raise the walls of the LA River to get rid of more of the water we needed. You asked the question about what's it gonna to take to change LA DWP. To make change happen is, it's a two-way street. They didn't believe that people in LA would recycle until tree people said, no, we teach people how to recycle and if you let us do it, we can move LA. Whereas across the country, all cities were getting on average 10% participation in recycling. We delivered 90. Just like in the drought of the 70s, when we showed that we were willing to save water, government went, oh, wow, if you're willing to do that, we'll help you. We'll give you the money to swap out your toilets. And that worked so powerfully. It reduced our water use, and it's never come back up above what it was in the 70s. These trees are not only here to decorate the city, but they're also here to cool the city and provide shading and cooling. These trees are gonna save lives. Hi, uh, board, my name is Carlos Mora. I'm senior director at Tree People. And before I even uh, uh, begin to address the support, I really wanna acknowledge everyone who's here today wearing green, todos los que están aquí en soporte de los parques, um, everyone who's here, all the voters, um, who made sure that, um, that, that we have more park access and that it is equitable. We recognize that parks are a critical fabric uh, for our region, and it ties together, as we've heard, public health, uh, mental health, but also economic health, housing health, um, and let's not forget watershed health. 